so today I want to share with you some products that I really enjoy uh, using throughout the month of October I am so so sorry for really bad noise outside but there's a lot of um, echo construction work going on so I just want to quickly take you through the products um, maybe starting with the palettes just because they're here um, I have been really loving this um, Too Faced palette let me just check the name of it it has um, Jingle All The Way this is the name and this is a palette basically in the shape of an iPhone so you have the iPhone cover I never really use it and you have uh, nine eyeshadows that are sparkling, two matte ones, bronzer and a blusher. This is really, really, really cool palette. Um, the colors are really nice, the payoff is really good. But what I like the most about it is that it's super, super tiny. So you can really take it with you on the go. And um, I really, really like mixing mainly um, these neutral, these four neutral colors. I really love my uh, browns so this is definitely a winner another I have two more palettes I've been loving palettes this month and this one is by Urban Decay and it is an um, eyeshadow palette it has um, five eyeshadows I really really like using this purple one I uh, mixed with um, golden and browns but it also has it has a um, lip pencil but i took it out and i forgot to put it back in but what i love 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 about it is this um highlight this highlighter is amazing all of those products have great pigmentations um i mean urban decay is known for their very very good quality and I also love this blusher. I'm not too keen on this pink one, but I really, really love this natural one. And you can get this palette in Sephora. And as I said, it always co it also comes with a lip product. So it's really a win. And the name of it is a Shattered Face Case. So, um, third and not last, I mean, last of the palettes that I want to share with you is actually last year's uh, Too Faced Be Merry. It, it comes in a kit of two palettes and I personally really, really love this one. This one is a uh, more beigey brown colors and of course with um, two, one blush and one bronzer or you can kind of use this as blushers. And I've been loving this palette. I especially love, you know, the um, buttered rum color, which is a gold one, and the uh, bubbly. It's really, really cute. I'm not keen, too keen on this green one, but maybe I'll get to use it. And as with all Too Faced palettes, you can see here that there is a um, guide on how to use them, how to use the color. So this is really, really cool. They are not very expensive, taking into consideration that you're getting two palettes and not one. Moving into um, mascara, I've been, I've included the Better Than Love mascara again by Too Faced. Too Faced is probably one of my favorite uh, brands, but um, I like this mascara. It's not amazing. I like the wand. But the problem is the formulation really, really dries out on my eyelashes. So maybe after three to four hours of application, it's not really great. Like the mascara, the color is good, the quoting, you know, I get very long lashes, but it's just like a concrete on my eyes. It dries out, you know, if it flakes down, it, I get like a black fallout. I like the packaging, but it is very heavy. Um, and I just prefer YSL or Lancome mascaras. Moving on to the lips. Um, so as those of you who live in Middle East probably know that um, Wuju has launched their um, own beauty line, which is the Wow by Wuju. And I have gotten two lip stacks. One is a gold rose and another one is sugar tan. And this is like, I mean, you cannot see very well the color. But this is pretty much like a um, stay all day um, matte finish. 
lipstick and I really really love obviously my favorites are from Sephora but these are very good as well uh, they are very very affordable uh, when it comes to the pricing I'm sorry for the light changing but my ring light is just going mad um, but yeah it is um, it has a great color I really really enjoy the nudes they're both one is this one is more brown you can see better now and this one is more uh, pinky toe so this is one the pinky toe and the brown one is just more nude so I 100% recommend them they have great color payoff and they're very very affordable um, another very affordable lip products that I've been loving this month is um, excuse the looking of it it's the Maybelline 175 um, lipstick it's pretty much like a raspberry color it is coming out much darker on the camera than it actually is and I have been loving this color for um, just autumn winter cooler months I wear a lot of uh, green like a uh, army green and black so this one this looks really 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 great with it so I've been loving this lipstick and it's very affordable you can find it in every supermarket everywhere so it's about 50 dirhams so it's a great price and a great product moving on to face I have uh, I used to use this uh, gel I'm not gonna butcher uh, French it's just a foaming gel cleanser purity and anti-pollution uh, by Chanel I've used this previously a uh, good few years ago when I was in university and it had a different packaging it just was like in a squeezy tube but I am still loving this the only thing is it does have tendency to dry out your skin so if your skin is very dry I do not recommend it and then even if you're like my skin is mixed so I would have to use a lot of moisturizer in combination with this but this really really does um, clean out your pores and you know make sure that you don't have any blemishes which is great and I love the packaging It's really really big bottle it has 150 milliliters so it will last you forever um, moving on to moisturizer um, I have been on a quest to finish this collagen replumper so I have been using it a lot this month uh, I'm pretty much it's pretty much empty I have just few just this part left to use up so I will probably throw it out today but um, I would not repurchase it because it is very uh, thick uh, but there is a one that's uh, by L'Oreal and it's in the tube it's like a silver blue tube that is much better than this it is not bad it is just too heavy especially if you live um, in the Middle East where we have a lot of heat and humidity it does it can uh, clog your pores but it is a very it does a great job of hydrating so if your um, kind of skin needs that this is a really really great moisturizer and then probably my most used and most favored uh, product of this month which is this super regenerating oil serum it this is amazing I love the way it smells I apply it all over my face day and night it is very good even to use under uh, makeup again not if you have oily skin but if you have a uh, dry skin this is really 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 good um, I love oil based products I love oil based perfumes as you can I'll be talking to you about this those two uh, products which are 100% um, oil based so yes I've been loving this Sephora oil it is again quite affordable and available uh, throughout all Sephora stores in Middle East um, now moving into the hair when it comes to hair care I have really really huge problems with my hair because I got them burned um, when I went to the hairdresser they burned them off so I really don't want to cut my hair any more than I had to so I have been using this uh, organ oil from Morocco this is by American brand called organics and this is available everywhere in live pharmacies you probably get you get like two for one which is nothing because one costs about 49 50 dirhams and as you can tell this bottle is empty I have I already stock up on it this is penetrating oil there is also deep penetrating oil I prefer the deeper deep penetration oil better 
because just my hair is very damaged but I apply this before workouts uh, maybe night before I'm gonna have to wash my hair I can apply a lot of it and it just it's a dry oil so your hair will soak it up and I really 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 recommend it and then oops last but not least are my favorite favorite uh, perfumes I have had this bottle for a while and this is Ajmal in uh, silk mask or musk silk it's basically an oil based based perfume that just smells divine it is a um, oriental fragrance so if you do not like strong smells it's probably not it's not going to be your cup of tea but it is very sensual it's very feminine again it's oud based so it is very strong i love oil perfumes because the best thing about it is that the f the smell gets released throughout the whole day it doesn't only gets released when you just put it on which is what happens with um you know alcohol based perfumes it lasts much longer i sometimes just take a few drops and mix it with my moisturizer you know if you want to kind of very very um strong smell so i definitely recommend this product i've been loving it so this is the last um item of my october favorites Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!